side on Local Memphis Live. Welcome back, everybody. Check out these beautiful items. First of all, gorgeous painting, fine art, pottery, jewelry, and other gifts by over 70 local artists. Now, that's what you can expect at Alley Cat Arts. That's right. Nicole Phillippe is here to show us some of the local paintings and to tell us more about how you can support the artists. Thank you so much for joining us Thank today. you so much for having us. We're so, excited to be here. Yeah, we're excited to have you. Yep. What can folks expect once they come out to the Alley Cat? Well, we have a little bit of everything. Wow. We've got... Um, now we actually have over 80 local artists, and so we've got um, fine art, we have pottery, jewelry, gifts, um, metal work, pretty much everything. We even have some handmade clothing. And, wow. it's, and it's all from around here, y'all are all local. Cooper Young. So let's start with the big painting, which is just eye-catching. I love it. Oh, thanks. We brought that in specially for the show. We haven't even had it framed yet. That is um, by Barry Joyce, and it's kind of his version of South Maine. Oh, yeah. yeah. Kind of did his own take on it. <gasps> he is one of our um, most popular artists. We have a lot of other works by him as well. Oh, my okay. So and talk colorful. about some of the other items on the table. Well, we have a collection of um, jewelry, different different artists, all different styles. Um, we also what are we have right there? Beautiful handmade. Jewelry. Yes. Uh, we've got fused glass, we've got metal, uh -huh. we've got kind of the mixed media steampunk. Um, there's a mixed media sculpture. Now, by what is Kenny this Hayes. little sculpture? That's by Kenny cheap. Hayes. Yeah, he, he <laughs> takes um, discarded artifacts and he collects um, bits and pieces of different things and puts them together and makes these fun, whimsical totally mixed funky. media sculptures. So are these products, these items, are they for sale? They are for sale. Okay. And people are just able to come out and not only purchase, people can actually talk to the artists? Absolutely. Yeah, our artists are in all the time, so you never know who you're going to meet. Yeah. Um, and then sometimes we also have special events and shows where we'll have, you know, all the artists come and we'll have like a party and a reception and everything. Well, why is this important? I mean, some people just shop online or, do, or, or you know, go the easy route to get things and, and purchase items, but this is really important for the local artists to keep that industry going. Absolutely. There's so many talented, amazing, wonderful artists here in Memphis, and part of the problem is that there's just not enough um, venues and mm -hmm. enough places to show, and then, you know, it's also kind of hard to find the right place to show your work. Right. So you have, you know, the, the big high-end galleries, and then you have kind of your, yeah. you know, lower gift shop kind of places. We're I kind of that. like, we're very funky, very eclectic, and we're right in the middle, and um, we're all about supporting um, the local artists and bringing quality, affordable art mm -hmm. to the community. And real quickly, when, what day can folks come out and purchase and check out the... We are currently open Thursday and Friday nights mm -hmm. from 4 to 8. Awesome. Saturday, 11 to 8, and Sunday, 12 to 6. Nicole, thank you so much for joining us. Thank you so much for having me. And there's more information on your screen. And, of course, if you didn't catch it, we have all that info on our website. Go to your iPads, iPhones, mobile device, and head to our website, localmemphis.com, and click on the Find It link. Keep it here. More to come on Local Memphis Live. Still ahead, we're going to be getting a taste of what Imagine Vegan Cafe has yes. to offer, and it smells really good. <laughs> but first, time to get your yard ready for spring. Greg Black is here to show you how you can get curb appeal.